Greetings, educators. Today I want to share with you my homework chart and packets that I pass out weekly. So this is an example of my students' homework folder. Inside I have a letter about myself on the first day of school. Um, on the return to school side, I have my procedures about homework, my reading log, graded work, classwork, behavior, and then the student and parent sign to show that they've read how things go in the classroom. But the focus today is the weekly homework chart. Now, if I take this out of the front pocket, you can also see some other things related to it. So every Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday, there is reading homework, along with reading for 20 minutes in a book every night. And I use the Open Court Phonics books that are free and found online at Open Court Wagoski. For language, there's homework on Monday and Tuesdays. Math, we're working up to every day this week or every day in the week. But at this point, it's just Wednesday and Thursday math homework. And spelling, they have spelling a little bit every night. So instead of handing out random sheets of paper during the week like I used to when I first started teaching, I hand out a packet on Monday. Um, the front of the packet is also a newsletter to the parents. It's what the student will be learning that week, spelling words, dictation sentence, and what's happening at the school. I also post that same page to my blog. Um, on the inside front cover, I have my homework policies for the parents to see. And these are links to different sites online that the students can practice skills. And on the blog, these are hyperlinks. So all the parent has to do or the student has to do is click. Um, I teach cursive in second grade, so I have it broken down. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, um, handwriting homework for language. We have Monday and Tuesday for reading. Um, everything is broken down into days. Reading, Monday, Tuesday, reading, Wednesday, where the child would read the passage answer one question on Wednesday, another question on Thursday. Um, math, again, it's right now we're just having math on Wednesday and Thursday. As the year progresses, math will be every day during the week. And then spelling, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. And of course they write the word three times and a dictation sentence every night. And on Thursday night, hopefully the parents are quizzing their children on their spelling words. So if a child misses out on homework for a night, then they can catch up the next night. I pass out the packets on Monday. Everything should be finished by Friday. If not, I'll sit with the child during maybe recess or sometime during the day where we might have a free moment to help them understand what's going on and complete their homework for the week. I hope this helps. Peace.